cutting $5.5 million. That is the big decision facing Hickman Mills School District. They got to find a way. As 41 Action News reporter Stephen Dial learned, the vote on whether to close multiple schools was delayed tonight, right, Stephen? Rhiannon, it was delayed, and it's a huge decision cutting $5.5 million from the budget that could impact hundreds of families and teachers could possibly lose their jobs. So how did we get here? Tonight was a packed meeting, but only a few people spoke to the board today about the possible cuts. An outside consultant recommended that multiple things happen, including at the worst, closing four of the eight elementary schools in the district and consolidating the sixth grade school to the middle school and the ninth grade school to Ruskin High School. Take a listen at a couple of people who spoke tonight. The very people that we want right now to be concentrating strictly on working with our students so we can have another year of excellent test scores and we can get full accreditation back next year instead of them sending out resumes on where they're going to work next year. It's a very sensitive matter and we are not taking it lightly. We don't want to make any decision that is going to disrupt this community. Uh, that's information that's very critical for certified staff to know at this point in time so that they can plan for the future, including the immediate future. Uh, we need to know this. It's critical. Now, part of the reason why the district is in this situation, declining enrollment, but also an error from Jackson County when it comes to tax revenue estimates and the school board trying to meet a goal of having a 15% fund balance, the school board will make a final vote on March 7th. Reporting, Stephen Dial, 41 Action News.